Hello YouTube, this is my first video on the Android tutorial for the wireless ADV connection to the Android Studio. As you guys can see here, none of the devices are connected to my computer right now. Ok, let me connect one. This is my Samsung Galaxy and I am going to plug it into my computer right now. Ok, it's now showing the device. It's, right now it's connected by USB cable but our goal is to make it via Wi-Fi or wireless so let me keep it aside and focus on how to do that first of all you need to open up the command prompt and type ADV if it works or not it's not working right now you need to do a couple of things to make it work just copy this code I will be providing you this in the description section below copy and paste it here Mm, this this is actually this is the location of the SDK on your computer which you guys can see on my computer right over here it's PC E SDK and platform tools you guys can just copy it and paste it over here okay and press enter and you need to do the same thing for this one too but in place of platform tools, just copy paste the logos of the tools only and press enter. And you just need to straight copy the thought code and paste it. Okay, now ADB should be working fine. Yes. Okay, now. Okay, before we before we use this course, we need to make sure one thing that um, both of our devices that is your deck computer and your android devices should be on the same network to make it happen okay my computer is on this network and similarly you guys are seeing that my mobile is on same network too okay now go to the advanced section and just focus on the IP section, IP address of the mobile. It's 72.3. Okay. And now you guys can copy this code directly. You guys can provide any of the uh, port number. Actually, this is the port number for your mobile. Oh, for the for your TCP IP connection, and you guys can provide any of the code port number. For now, I'm providing. 5554 and I'm going to press enter. It says restarting the TCV mode port 5554. And you guys can see that my device is being restarted. Oh, I mean, reconnected to the computer. And let me paste the second code. This code is going to connect my device to the computer. Okay, actually, it was 72.3. I believe okay. and it says connected to this one now you guys can see on Android Studio that you have two devices connected over here but actually these two devices are same physical device but the upper one is connected via Wi-Fi and the below one is connected via USB the wireless connection also lets you uh, let's you have the feature that um, let's you have the same feature that the USB USB plugin app. You guys can just compile the code and burn it to the device via wirelessly, and also you guys can see the monitor and monitor via wirelessly. Okay, and if you want to disconnect the device, the code is right here. This one, and I believe it works fine right now. But in, you need to provide the correct IP as before 72.5. Oh, sorry, 3. Okay, it says restarting in US mode and the device reconnects. Similarly, you guys might be thinking what if you don't have a router at home? 
then the easy answer to fix that would be to use the Zapier application on the laptop. You guys probably you guys probably have the Zapier application on mobile, Android mobile. And you just need to download the Zapier for the and uh, uh, computer, and you guys need to connect them through Zapier. And a similar process goes on for seeing the IP address on mobile and use the, uh, that IP address in the section and you guys can see your device will be connected via wirelessly to the Android Studio okay now I have already disconnected via wirelessly this is showing only on the USB okay here we complete our tutorial uh, for you got please like and subscribe to the channel for more upcoming videos thank you